pirates, ninjas, we all know them as our current world government. But weren't they extinct? Where did they come from? Where are they going? Are they here to stay? The answer, as always, lies somewhere in the middle. So let us jump right into the middle of history. Before we can explain anything, we must first examine the history of the ninja clan Kuso Kubi. They were a group of elite assassins who secretly ruled over Japan during the Chimpo era. Over the years, their numbers have dwindled. The last ninja is thought to have perished in the 60s before the current world government came into power. He was murdered by a secret agent codenamed Ball. But now we know the truth. Where there is a master, there is also a student. Sensei! Sensei! Sure! Remember! With the great power comes the great... Oh, not again! The general's going to kill me! Fast forward through the 70s, 80s, and let's not talk about the 90s. The last ninja simply reappears, fighting his rival, the pirate. But who is this pirate? Why do they fight? To answer these questions, here is our resident pirate specialist, Dr. Alexander Hall. Basically, all existing pirates live in constant anarchy, as is their way. This particular pirate simply one day got too drunk and fell overboard. From his autobiography, we learn that he spent months at sea, surviving only on rum and the fungi he halves through his feet. The pirate and ninja are causing destruction all over the world. Now, the World Government Organization does not take this lightly. So they send out a hired gun. And we can only describe this man as a badass. A punk even. And he does feel lucky. He is our one and only leader, king and emperor of the world government. The badass punk motherfucker. The fight is truly epic. It is said to have gone on for days, though some say that it was over in the blink of an eye. Within the heat of battle, friendship sprouted, and later on, fueled by alcoholic beverages, it blossomed into the alliance that we know today. Meanwhile, the world government was not pleased with the BPM's performance. He was relieved from his duty and replaced by a robot. It is said that the head of the World Government Science Department saw his frustrations and convinced the BPM to fight the metal monstrosity, to prove his worth to his former employers. Teaming up with the pirate and ninja, BPM confronts the robot and against all odds defeats him. It is speculated that they used a dirty trick to win, but it's also possible that it was just dumb luck. We may never know. But what we do know is that the world government was not happy with the destruction of their million dollar fighter. When the council declined to give the BBM his job back, he swore vengeance, teamed up with the pirate and ninja, and raided the WGO headquarters. But the council had one last trump card up their sleeves, turning themselves into a vicious viking, a cool cowboy, and a cunning commando, they met the rebels Head on. Tales have been spun of the epicness of the fight. Songs have been sung of its awesomeness. And sometimes when no one's listening, voices whisper that was actually really silly. To give you an impression of the amazingness that went on in that fight, here is an eyewitness report. That fight was so f***ing amazing, I nearly shit my pants. <laughs> Oh wait, I did! <laughs> what happened? The pirate, ninja and BPM defeated the viking, cowboy and commander, thereby becoming the leaders we love and fear to this day. But what happened to the leader of the old world government organization? The mysterious man that no one has ever seen in real life. Some say that this main scientist who worked for the world government was actually him, in disguise. Other people say 
that he was actually secretly a dinosaur. Others say that that's just plain silly. As always, the truth lies somewhere in the middle. Someday, the world might know. But until then, we will be in the middle of history. Okay, I'm just gonna get angry now. I'm gonna shoot you. What you say? What you say? First of all, no more damn closing time for bars. Ah! Stay out of my way and... <coughs> Anyone else wanna go? <laughs>